back a new foundation. And I'm going to be putting it in a haul soon. I just And then I put a new concealer on. The bronzer is a Max Color Rich bronzer. And then for mascara, it's the Buxom mascara um, from the Swap. And then um, eyeshadow, I use the Naked palette, my Inglot palette, and the Steel palette because there's all different colors that I like for each one. And I hit pan, pan on the, um, the kitten, and I was sad because it's my favorite. Um, but for my outfit, I just have the Gap jacket on, and then I have my Urban Outfitters plaid shirt on. And jewelry is just like this, rose gold fossil watch, and then a J. Crew cheetah headband. Steven bought me this CD red because I've been wanting it for a while now, and I'm very excited because my favorite. I'm so excited. Go back to that song. It's my favorite. This is my favorite song. This is my favorite song. It's Holy Ground, number 11. <laughs> And then on my lips, I have Max Up the Amp. This one is really pretty. I wore this on Halloween, my. That's why it's all messed up. <laughs> yeah, we don't know how much. <laughs> yeah. I have so many coupons. Like, these are all Bath and Body Works coupons. Like, all $10 off crap. In the parking deck of my college, this is so awkward because I feel like there's someone who's going to walk by and be like, what the hell are you doing? But um, today I have my history debate. Um, yeah, I'm really nervous. I have them on cute index cards though, like pink and orange. <sighs> I'm nervous because you have to talk for three minutes in your group and like I'm an argument and I just don't like debates. It's like a 200 people lecture and I have to like talk. I'm really nervous. Oh, I don't want to do this. Because like I didn't read any of the other articles. Like why the hell am I going to read other articles? I have other things to do in my life besides studying for history. So I just read my article, like one paragraph of this speech of what I did. Basically I just was like, okay. And I, I tried to practice with my boyfriend last night and he just laughed at me. He's like, good luck with that. So, I'm just going to go first and get it over with. Oh god, there's someone walking. I'm just going to go first and get it over with so I don't have to, like, dread it. Because I have bad speaking anxiety. I have everything. I can't go in front of large groups. I can't speak in front of people. Like, whatever. So, yeah. So, that is my day today. And then I'm going to go probably to Walgreens and get toothpaste and the new Wet n Wild matte palette because I really, really want it. So I will talk to you guys later after I completely embarrass myself in front of 200 kids. Bye! Okay, sorry for the lighting or whatever. I'm driving through campus and I go to Walgreens now and get toothpaste and like Wet n Wild palettes, but oh my god, we won our debate, bitches! I was so excited. I was like the second person on my debate to, um, to talk and oh my god, my hand was shaking so so bad and I was just like oh my god do not stumble over your words speak loud enough and I was just like oh. so I was talking and then like the judges that like judged me like two of them were my friends so of course I picked my side because that would just be incredibly awkward um hang on so I try and look in the light but yeah so that was well I'm glad that it's over with because that was just like three minutes about history like geez like peep people like I can barely talk 30 seconds about history class so I was thoroughly impressed with myself that I was able to talk about it and be passionate about it so I'm going to Walgreens now getting the wet and wild palette because I really want it I'm just going to get the matte one not the shimmery one because I have so many shimmers um palettes but I really want a full matte palette I think this is going to be so beautiful especially when it gets colder with like a bright red glossy lip it's going to be gorgeous so I will see you guys later probably when I get home so bye bed's not made because um 
I just did laundry. So I'm just really annoyed because I got this stuff at Ulta the other day. It's Mario Badescu. I don't know. I'm from the South, y'all. I don't know what those kinds of words, but the Mario Badescu Skincare Special Mask for Oily Skin. So let's get into the light. I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh. And I just ate. I ate cookout. If you guys are from the North and not the South, I, it's so sad and depressing because cookout is like our way of life. I love cookout. It is so good. Anyway, back on this. It's the special mask for oily skin. And it was like freaking $18. That's good buffering lotion. And I love this stuff. Like you shake it up and you put it on like any active acne or like cysts or anything underneath the skin. And it's like takes away it. The Mario Badescu oily skin. I did it this morning and I went out and I did my errands and stuff. I come back and my face is just as oily as it was like on any other day. So I'm freaking returning this. And it just pissing me off because I just went and returned something and now I have to go return another product. You know, so that's just frustrating. Hello everybody. Hope you're having a fabulous Thursday morning at 7.30. More than I am right now. I am freezing my little arse off in my car driving to school and it is 27 degrees out and my window is completely iced like I don't know how to fix this because I just got this car um, in the summer like end of summer so I never had to like use the whatever the heat for my window and like my boyfriend's like in the summer, oh, you should do it, you should do it. Okay, Steven, yeah, I did it. Oh, I know how to do it, but I did it because it's like, why the hell am I going to do that in the summer? I'm tanning. So it was like all this ice on, and I was like, oh, it's okay. I have an ice pick in my car. Steven flipping took it when he went to work the other day. He put it in his damn car. So I'm going to tell my daddy, and my daddy is going to kill him because he bought that for me at Walmart. I'll be like, Dad, he took my little ice thing, and he's going to be like, okay, I hate him. I'm joking. But still, I'm like so cold right now. I'm going to be so mad at him. And he's just sleeping, having little sugar plums above his head in the bedroom, and I'm just like flipping cold. I don't think kids should be driving to school this early. So I'm going to be going to class, and I have to walk across campus, and it's so cold out. And it just dropped two degrees, so now it's like... Oh, it's 25 degrees. It's so cold. And class is canceled. This has happened before where it was so cold. And I was walking across campus. And I get there and one other girl's there. And he canceled the lectures for that day. I was, let's just say, I swore. I swore so bad that day. I was so pissed off. Anyway, I will talk to you guys later. I'm going to the mall today to get my mom's one present and then Steven's Christmas presents and then um, probably my sister-in-law's Christmas present. so I will talk to you guys later. Bye. We got this Christmas tree and it was $40, six and a half foot Christmas tree at Wally Mart and Steven is putting it in the car and we got bows for it and we got, what else did we get? We got all that stuff in there so next time you see it, it will be all decorated. Welcome to the booties. <laughs>